What's up guys, my name is Ace, this is Gaming Revolutions, we are here, we are going to talk to you about Mr. You Can't See Me, Mr. Five Knuckle Shuffle, John Cena, his WWE plans and his WWE future. Now, we all know the people power has came to an end, and the Big Show and John Cena feud has also came to an end, so what does that mean for John Cena? Well, WWE Creative have came up with an idea to insert John Cena in the Money in the Bank pay-per-view ladder match and have him go on and win. Now, I don't know about what you guys think, you know, some of you may love John Cena, but that is, if you think about it closely, with all these guys that deserve a title match like Dolph Ziggler and Cody Rhodes and, you know, so many other people, it would be really stupid to put him into a match and steal the spotlight for so many other guys, you know. The money in the bank for so many years have been, you know, guys that have been underestimated, like CM Punk. CM Punk won it two years in a row. Um, Mr. Kennedy, he won it for a while and it got taken away by Edge. It's been, you know, people that haven't always been at the top. And putting him into that little scenario with money in the bank would totally be a fail. I think it would be everybody already knowing, okay, John Cena is going to win once they see him on the pay-per-view card and money in the bank. But WWE officials and creative have scrapped that idea. They're not going to do that anymore. And which is, that's pretty that's pretty good in my opinion. So reported earlier this week, Cena is expected to face CM Punk at SummerSlam for the WWE Championship. Him winning Money in the Bank would have been bad. But if you think about it, SummerSlam, John Cena versus CM Punk for the WWE Championship... It's also bad because this is the second year in a row we get John Cena and CM Punk. Last year, it was Triple H thrown into the mix as a special guest referee. This could mean low pay-per-view buys. Who knows? But, of course, we all know that John Cena will not win the title from CM Punk at SummerSlam. But possibly, from, like I said, what reports show is that possibly John Cena will win the... Boston, when they're in Boston for night of yeah for night of champions, John Cena will most likely win because it's in his hometown. If he doesn't win, we can expect John Cena in the WWE title picture for the remainder of 2012, and John Cena is expected to compete for the WWE championship and remain in the picture until 2013. I want to know what you guys think. Um, do you think that John Cena is getting? A little bit too much. He's a top baby face. He doesn't need to he doesn't need the title to stay relevant. Do you think that it's time that Dolph Ziggler, who's getting us tremendous cheers and you know, even commentators are trying to cover it up, but do you think it's his time? I wanna know what you guys think. You know, comment below, tell me who you think should compete with the WWE championship or world heavyweight championship. Tell me what you think about John Cena getting another shot at the WWE Championship. That means another C Nation ever. Eh, I mean, ever. See? Another C Nation era. And I'm tired of it, honestly. Uh, I would rather pay to see Vicky Guerrero win the championship. See how far that goes. But, you know, I will bring you more information as news comes available. Subscribe to my channel. Smash that like button, comment below, tell me everything that you know you want to get off your chest, what makes you so angry about WWE, and I promise you, you will not be disappointed with the content that goes up on this channel. So everybody, you guys have a good day. My name is Ace, this is Gaming Revolution. Good night.